Hey, Eben, uh, just want to give you a quick update here on where we are. Um, let me um, pull up the uh, product page. I definitely see what you mean here. We're going to have to uh, switch over to the mobile um, a little quicker because this is wrapping, and that's not, uh, we don't really want that. So I think the best thing to do is do that at about an, let me see here. There's a couple things I can do to fix this wrapping. Um, that, so that's not a big issue, but I think we want to switch it over to uh, mobile probably around, I'm going to say 1025 pixels, which is about, it's roughly iPad size. So in this general area right here. Um, so I'll work on that, but I'm basically sort of working through, let's go over to Hadrian. Um, So I think we're good on the uh, the order of things here. So we've got the authentic coin description, got the related products, and I'm going to go through that with you in just a second. And then down here we've got the designer notes, the care instructions, and the customer service. Now we should see a, oh, okay, so here's the share. And I noticed one of these is an email, which we need to convert over to, well, I guess we can do an email, but uh, it needs to be, if you want to share it via email, it's just basically bringing up the, your email address. We want this to be mailed to whoever, you know, it, the person wants to fill in the address for. So anyway, I'll get that all taken care of. So here's the related products. And the way this is going to work is um, it's going to grab the three products that aren't the one showing on the particular page. So if we have Hadri in here, <clears throat> then this will be the other three. And if we go into um, Marcus Aurelius, then it'll be the other three other than Marcus Aurelius. So that's kind of how I've set that up. And again, I'll, uh, I'll, I'll go back and review the emails here to see what the plan is for this image. But I think we want that image uh, to be the same as these two, and then that'll smooth everything out. So the other thing I need to do here is, is the styling, um, because what it's doing is it's picking up the product card from the collections page <clears throat> and so the hovers were all going to be kind of that same black hover thing but i don't know that we want the hover state you know we've got this situation where we've got these nice floating pieces and i can put some borders around it and the red is just my that's a place marker for me um you know we can put some borders around it to kind of set it off but i i, I think we want the hover state to be fairly simple so let's say we we hover and we're just going from, you know, from silver to, or gold to silver, gold to silver, that kind of thing. Um, but I don't necessarily think we want that black background on the hover. Um, so, but what I need to do is work out a few bugs because right now you can see that if we start to hover from below, it's got this flicker, um, which is why I'm trying to get this. I, I think that has to do with the, the height of the container that is surrounding it. And right now, that container is, um, you know, it's, oh, there we go. That's what we want it to look like, that full, uh, the full height as opposed to this sort of compressed deal right here. So, um, so anyway, I will get that figured out, but that's kind of where we are with that. So once I get this styled, I mean, functionally, it's perfect because um, if you click it, you'll go into that product but I need to style it. And so that's what I'm working on here. So, and then I'll go in and I'll add that to this. This is a completely different um, theme that I think Ritu put together. So I'll add those components in here um, that will pick up the same components as, um, as the other ones. So, so that's where we're at. So if you go to Hadrian, um, I think really the question would be right now, is on the um, related products. What would you like to see when it's in its unhovered state? Uh, which I kind of like the just the float. Although maybe, like I said, with a with a gentle border around it, maybe a little bit of a of a radius to that border, so it's kind of a soft. Um, you know. Now we do have it. I mean, this this floats up here. So, uh, so it's not necessarily out of the question that these would float, but it's up to you. So, um, so let me know what you think on that, and then um, and I'll uh, I'll keep keep working away. Talk to you later.